anymore. There it is. Oh, uh, another small bonus. The mosquitoes can block some shocks because they have a hit point bar. So sometimes you'll, you know, the mosquito will be going at an enemy and it'll block a couple shots on its way to the enemy. Welcome to Arrival. Hello! Oh, wait, what was that? Found a container there. Five copper ingots. Oh, that, that must have been how I got copper ingots earlier. Are they just drop in this city? Already in ingot form? I see a book. What's that? Blood Moon Chess Guard. Upgrade. We, we already had the leggings. The leggings was the only piece of the set we had. We just got the chest piece. Yay! Progress, chat. Progress. Upgrades, people. Upgrades. No containers in here? Your shop sucks. Oh my gosh, this guy's got the jukes! Let's see. Job luck is so good. I mean, <laughs> I, I mean, I, I don't know if I would say that if it, with how long I've spent before this happened, but I'm happy in the now. When you the hold the move where um, what is it called? Howling Reaper, where you throw it. It's noticeably stronger ever since getting the Sanguine Reaper. Intentionally knocked him away from the mosquito. Oh, this guy's 85%. I might have me a nibble. It'd be kind of fun having a minion that. It would be kind of fun having a minion with that guy's model uh, because he was like eight feet tall. It's just just having the minion be that tall. But yeah, that, dude, that death animation. He was like, oh no, you killed me. Oh, what do I do? <laughs> I'm looking for more houses that have containers to loot. Although my bag is almost full again. Oh, there's one. Run! 
Exterior light and imperious fountain. Oh boy. There's a lot of containers in here. Alright, it's time. I'm having to leave stuff behind now. It's time. Alright, let's take this stuff back and see if we can stitch together that uh, armor upgrade. So Maryland reached 10 million players, clearly game of the year. Nice! Bad form is cute. Mm hmm. Bats are cute. Bats, they're just, bats are just like the puppies of the sky. We've got land puppies, we've got sea puppies, and we've got sky puppies. And we got hush puppies. pick the cotton that I've got there, but I need to drop stuff off first. Uh, 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 uh. There's that. And that. Oh boy. <laughs> yeah, it's taking a while for it to chew through all this. What is this? Brew of Ferocity. Oh, that's kind of cool. We just looted some potions that we can use that were just like already baked and ready to go. Ooh, how do you? Hello, gangsta. How do, how do I what? Why not just fly direct to base? So I was over here. So teleporting from there to here was surely faster than flying all the way home. That's that's why. Okay. Uh, I don't think I've got any more scroll researches I can do, because I think I got everything at the study. Yeah. I'm still missing a bunch of stuff at the research desk and tons of stuff at the 8th and AM. All right. Blood Moon Chest Guard. What was the other book I had? Exterior Lights and Imperious Fountain. Do I already have that? Oh, I already have that. Okay, so we're gonna salvage this. And then discover a random one. Sanguine Axes. All right. You can TP with loot now. It depends on the server you're on. The server that I'm on um, allows it. It's in the, the, the settings of the host of the server. Okay, so we got the Sanguine Axes recipe. And okay, getting distracted. I got a lot to do. Put that away. Put that away. Put that away. Do ore nodes spawn more as you unlock the related crafting? Because I've not yet seen iron, but I just unlocked the smelt. So Beansy, um, on the world map, there's a ton of iron here in the iron mine. And it's scattered sporadically in every zone other than the first zone. It's kind of like iron is a resource that becomes available to you starting in the second zone, and then it's everywhere after. Watch this. Efficiency! Oh, we missed one. Almost perfect efficiency. All right, ore cabinet. Okay. Actually, swap that out with the gem dust. All right, the golden chains, put those here. 
Uh, fire resistance brew? I don't know when or if I'll need that. Stack this with that. Uh, put the cotton in the loom. Uh, keep that in the paper press. Are you serious? This doesn't seem worth doing at all. Six scrolls, spectral dust and silver ore are a pain to get, and you get one schematic. I was thinking, oh boy, these extra scrolls can go towards schematics, but the other ingredients suck. Ah, <sighs> okay, where's the tailoring bench? What do I need to upgrade my armor? Blood Moon chest guard. Nine Imperial Thread, six Silk, Primal Blood. Let's see, Silk, Imperial Thread, and I need Primal Blood. That's why Paper Press is awesome early, not much later. Great. Where's the other... I know I had other Primal Blood. I thought I did. Let me check the, the juicer. Oh, it's not even running right now. I guess there's not enough room for it. Okay, anyway. Not that. And Blood Moon Chest Guard takes two and a half minutes. I'm topless, oh no! Trying to remember if I had another dark silver weapon. Uh, this is PvE. My goal is to beat all the bosses if I can. I don't think I did. Oh, I did. No, here we go. Alright, let me swap these out. Okay. All right, so I had two dark silver weapons. So if we want to make, for example, the sanguine axes, we gotta make a sanguine, uh, the dark silver, uh, dark silver axes first. So 12 dark silver ingot and six reinforced plank. Reinforced planks. Evening muck. Hello, Scythian. Thank you. Muckla Douglas about thought of me, Reginald Desk by the fourth. This is Johnson Face Novels the third. Well, because you, Scythian, back to the lab. Hope you enjoy all saying entertainment is on the way. Crank up the speakers, don't touch the speakers, giveaways everywhere. Please take a seat, but you'll only need the edge. Mmm. Welcome. Alright, so we're making the axes, and then we need three flawless rubies and nine pristine leather to upgrade them when they're done. Pristine leather. Uh, wait, it's here. here we go. Ten seconds on the Blood Moon chest guard. And then we'll have two pieces of the four piece Blood Moon set. Which, as far as I know, may be the final set in the game. It would not surprise me if it's the final set in the game. Two-piece bonus, increase movement speed by 6%. Look at that popped collar, chat. Aren't we looking fabulous? Okay. Mm Still need the boots and the gloves, if possible. Is 
Is there a better cloak than what I've got? I guess not. Kind of surprises me how long in the game I've had the same cloak. Okay. Alright, so just waiting on Dark Silver Axes to finish, and then I'll immediately upgrade him to Sanguine. I've got a Dark Silver Mace, but I don't have the Sanguine Mace recipe. Okay, so Sanguine Axes are constructing now. So the other materials in my bag I can put back away. Put everything back where I normally keep it so I don't get confused later. I gotta say the um, was it the gem cutting station in this game makes me I can't I can't help but think of the Herodric cube when I use this because you just you combine crappy gems into better gems. I'm just constantly thinking of the Herodric cube. Get another bottle of the good stuff. Oh my god. Mmm. One rainbow trout, and then you eat two rats. As soon as I craft a bone gear set, I'm coming for your neck, even if it's PVE. I I will just lock the door. <laughs> my my defense against you with your bone weapons is I just lock the door. That's it. That's all I got to do. Oh, uh, I can actually put some more blood in the castle heart. I forgot about that. I'll just go to, uh, like, Noxie's castle and steal the little, like, home security sign from the front yard, and I'll put it in front of my castle so that you get scared and get ready and run away. <laughs> like, oh shoot, he's got a security system? Don't even need to lock the door, the NPC patrols will kill him on the way there. There was one time I logged into the game, and I was like, all right, I, I'm not on air right now. I'm just going to do farming. I, I, uh, I'm not going to kill any bosses because I want stream to see it. And then I opened my front door. That's it. I just, I opened the front door and Tristan the Vampire Hunter shot me in the face. And I was just like, cowabunga it is then. And I proceeded to kill Tristan. And that was the only hit he got off on me. That first, that cheap shot, that sucker punch was the only time he hit me. But yeah, he apparently, his patrol goes right in front of my front door. I did not realize that until that moment. All right, we have got Sanguine Axes. Very neat. Okay, uh, our old axe we are going to put into, this is where I put my old gear so that I can hand it to uh, the minions in case uh, it's better than anything that they've got. All right, so there's two pieces of gear I don't have right now. What was the one you said was the possibly the easiest? The, the winged horror. Ah, uh, you know what? I wanna, I wanna, in like within a half hour, swap over to our second game of the night. I think I'm gonna go try the winged horror. I've, I've got the good blood. Well, actually, I've got the. Here it is. It's right here. I've got the good blood. I've got the good potion. We can give it a shot. We're gonna fly over and we're gonna scope this guy out. This is one of the three remaining bosses in the game. Now, 
How, if I fail, how could I be better right now? There's two more pieces of Blood Moon armor, which would be a tiny bit more hit points per piece and a 6% increase attack speed. I mostly use spells, so that's not a huge thing. I don't know if there's a jewelry piece that is a higher level than this. Uh, Metsuni, if you or anyone else is here, just you can just tell me. Is is this the highest level jewelry, or is there a better one uh, for spellcaster fans? Um, I've got possibly best weapon. So uh, potion, buff potion, I could I could do better, and gloves boots I could do better. It is okay. So I'm not quite at cap, but I'm I'm near there. Flappy, 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 flappy. Oh, is this the one that you have to fly to to reach? What's up, buddy? Oh, dude, if the sun comes up and you're up here, you are gonna have a bad time. Ain't you? All right. Uh, I don't even think I could run. Like, <laughs> I don't think I could run to reset. Wait, can I hold shift and jump down? You can. Okay, so you can flee if you want to reset by probably jumping down. You technically get a better one after the last boss. That's raw stats and more teaser for future content. Okay. All right. <laughs> you want to do a prediction? Will Muck one-shot the winged horror? <laughs> I'm so confident. Ah. Here we go, chat. You know I will. You know I will. Uh, of the two bosses I've attempted today, I did one-shot one of them, chat. All right. We'll get we'll give it a minute for that. <sighs> okay. Let's see what he does. All right. So, he gets flanked by projectiles and he does a dash. That's beautiful, actually, but okay. I tried to block, but I didn't react in time. I don't know if that actually summoned a skeleton like it's supposed to. Wait, am I getting set on fire just by hitting him? Oh, come on. No! You suck! Okay, bombardment. Dude, I swear I'm getting hit. Like, I'm getting set on fire when I'm not actually getting hit by any mechanics. Okay. Oh my god. All right, I want to reset. I want to reset. You can use power surge to remove debuff. I might need it. I might need to do that. I've I've never um 
had a, a, a need to use Power Surge before, before now. The fire debuff is four minutes long. Oh, is that what it was? I kept thinking it was going away and re coming back when I would hit him. Although now that I'm thinking about it, every time I dashed, I would have gotten a shield and the damage would have stopped for a while. Maybe that's what I was seeing. All right, I'll try Power Surge. Oh man, that was that hurt that the mirror strike completely whiffed. I believe in you. Thank you, Bjorn. All right, I didn't I didn't one shot him. I'm on fire. Power surge. Well, that kind of sucked. Ninety two crit. That was nice. On fire again, power surge. Very good advice with the power surge thing. I've already used it. Now that I now that I'm aware that it's a freaking four minute debuff, that's huge. Having a cure for it. Okay, rude, first of all. Wow, I did power surge and got a, then I got set on fire after and then I got a free cast. No! Mistakes were made. Oh, I didn't get set on fire that time. I am surprised. Oh, watch the tail. Watch the tail. What is this debuff? Move Was that movement speed reduced by 5%, I think? Because the ice hit me? That's really weird how he does that little backpedal. Half health. If he has a phase 2, I expect to see it soon. We're halfway through nighttime right now. Oh, what? He lifted off again. Okay, this again. Oof. Oh, come on. Uh, I'm chilled. Remove it. Well, he really zones you out, doesn't he? Accidentally touched the fire, removed it. What was that? I got, like, pushed or something? Or I lagged? I don't know. Remove it again. And then I got chilled. Not enough cleanse in the world. Remove it again. Dang. Uh, is he going to do the strafing run again with the red circle? Yeah, he is. Okay. Only some of them make fire patches. They don't all make fire patches. Oh, you jerk. <laughs> He's like, get back in that fire. 